<clears throat> All right. Hi, everybody. It's me, Jordan here. And this will be the last time I ever respond to haters on this YouTube channel. Because as far as Sailor Moon Tube 11 is concerned, we have not made any video responses to them as a group in a while there. And as far as Power Rangers Red or, you know, TWF Cool 123 or Dwayne McCallum Rant, we don't have them respond to them at all lately. Now, this is going to be a video talking about how they act like. Now, some people might say, oh, that I'm contradicting myself, that they have gotten to me, and that I'm going to start making video responses with their username or their channel title, whatever. No, never doing that. This is the last time I ever talk about the way they act like, okay? Now, they think that the way that they're acting like is normal. They think that when you're on the online, they think that anything like manners or courtesy or being polite, they think that that doesn't apply. They think that the Internet is made for being a bully tool, you know, harassment tool, whatever you want to call it. They think that the only time you have to follow laws or rules or be polite or have good manners or be respectful is when you're offline. And that's wrong. That is a very bad way to think or to act like, you know. And they think that it's perfectly fine to do it. You know, they'll claim that they have the right to do it. They'll claim that they're doing something that they're allowed to do in real life. No, offline, if you harass and bully someone, you can get, you can get, you can get yourself, you can get restraining orders, arrested, committed, okay? So don't sit there and say that you're allowed to bully and harass people in real life. Because if you were doing that in real life, you could get yourself arrested or even, or can, you can get restraining orders put on your butt. Now, they think that anyone who's on the Internet and they're minding their own business or doing the normal thing, like following the community guidelines of YouTube, they think that's wrong. They actually think that they're tough because they hide behind laptops and desktops and tablets and mobile phones. But the truth is they're not. They're cowards. They're going to claim that I, ah, they're going to turn around and say, you have no evidence and proof you're the coward. They got deniability. But this is how they act like. They go like this. Well, yeah, you know what? I'm better than you. I want to bully and harass you because I got nothing better to do. So I just start writing and start spamming your comment section of your channel saying Jordan eats poop, Jordan eats poop, Jordan eats poop. Ha <laughs> ha, ain't I cool? No, they're not. You know, they would never say any of that to your face in real life. Okay, or offline as we also call it. So. They think they're brave because they did it behind a keyboard. But the truth is, they're not. They would never say any of that stuff to my face. Hey, are you going to say that I like to eat poop to my face? Um, no. No, I don't think so. Uh, no. No, bye. Plus, they wouldn't know you in real life either. They wouldn't know you offline. You know, there's people who claim they know their their victims, but the truth is they don't know their victims. You know, the truth is they just bully and harass and make up stuff about their victims. But they would never say or do any of that stuff offline, of course. You know, of course they wouldn't. They act all tough when they're behind the keyboard. Oh, don't mess with me. I'm behind a keyboard, and I can say and do anything I want. And there's nothing you can do about it.
But we all know that's a bunch of bull. Because you can do something about it. You can either ignore them. And that's what I pretty much do. I just, I just ignore them. You know, I don't need them respond to any of their channel comments or video comments or personal messages. I block and ban them. You know, or you can block and ban them. Of course, they don't want you to block and ban because they'll lose privileges left and right. Blocked, banned. Oh no, don't do that. Now I can't do anything. I can't come to your channel and I can't watch your videos or raid your videos or comment on your videos or your channel or send personal message or favorite or playlist. No! And there, in their mind, they're going to think, oh, I contradict myself. I'm responding to them. <clears throat> no, I'm not. I'm not addressing them individually. I am responding to them as a group, you know. So, no, it doesn't contradict. I'm not doing no contradictions. That's the way they act like. And it's pretty sad, you know. It's nothing to be proud of. You know. According to them, apparently being on block user and banned from channel, some type of award, some type of honor that they actually think is great. Well, it's not. <clears throat> okay. Being a bully or cyber bully, whatever type of bully you are, it's not good. I don't care what you people say to try to defend it. You can't defend bullying or cyber bullying or any type of it. Okay. So if you disagree about how you've been betrayed, I could, maybe you should start changing your ways if you feel upset or don't like the way that you've been betrayed. <clears throat> That's it. I'm Jordan Long. Hope you enjoyed this video.